Welcome to KNOW, your application guide. Here we will see how to create a supplier record in iValua. From the compass, located at the bottom right, I can access the different guides listed on my application. In Supplier, click on Supplier List. First of all, the guide installs you to check if the supplier does not already exist in your database. Once the verification is done, click on Create a new supplier. You are now redirected to a blank form. A sticker appears to list the necessary information for future use in iValua. At the same time, a guide is launched. Follow the steps to fill in your supplier's information and address. Once the profile information is filled in, I click on Save. A KNOW guide appears, telling me that I must fill in the SIREN number and the SIREN of the supply. It's the equivalent of the EDIS in the US. I fill in the missing fields, and I click on Validate. Once the form is created, the KNOW guide tells me to go to the Contact tab to assign one or more contacts. I fill in the contact fields and save. Now that my contact is created, a new sticker appears to indicate that a role must be assigned for each supplier contact. I close the sticker. I select the role I want to assign to my contact from the drop-down menu. It is indicated to me to send by email and access to the application. The following bubble integrates a link which returns towards an extranet portal on which EDM is arranged. KNOW then asks you to go to the Entity Tracking tab in order to activate your risk monitoring, the final guiding step is to go to the Approvals tab in order to describe the expenses contracted with the supplier. You are given the possibility to create one or more approvals according to the organizational and purchasing perimeter concerned, as well as its status. Once this information has been filled in, your supplier file is complete and ready to be validated by the risk department within 48 hours. Finally, a feedback request appears after each KNOW guidance. To measure both quantitatively and qualitatively, the level of user satisfaction. That's it, the demonstration is over. Thank you for your attention. Follow us on YouTube to be notified of our latest publications.